everyone welcome back to my channel it is me Marsha and today I am going to be doing some hair styles for you guys like just some easy hairstyles to show you guys what I do for my hair my hair is like a really awkward length right now because I did cut it short but now I'm like you know I want my hair like down to here so these are I'm just going to show you guys some easy hairstyles that I do for my hair and this is how it looks when I wake up in the morning um, I usually put it in a little when I go to bed I put it like in a scrunchie and that's why these creases are in here so this is how it usually looks in the morning but I'm gonna show you guys some easy hairstyles that you guys can do for your short awkward length hair or whatever so let's get right into this so guys usually when I wake up in the morning and I had my hair in a little ponytail then if I'm in a hurry, I would just comb the sides up like this, like right by my eyebrow, like I try to go even there. And then I will just put this section of my hair in a ponytail um, using a scrunchie or a smaller rubber band. I usually like using a scrunchie or one of the really tiny rubber bands because it just looks better to me. A scrunchie is my favorite way though because it makes it look like there's more hair there. And then I just pull it and make it look a little messy. And that's what I do if I'm in a hurry and I don't have time to do anything else with my hair. And the little bumps in my hair do come from my rubber band because I usually put it in a rubber band when I sleep. So, And I don't mind how that looks like if I put it in my ponytail because it looks like I kind of tried to do it that way. So now I'm going to show you guys how it looks with a smaller rubber band. I'm just going to put it in a little top bun. Uh, that's another easy way to style your hair in the morning if you don't have time to do anything. You just grab your hair, put it in a little bun on top of your head, and it looks so cute to me. I like the bun style too. Like that. That just looks so much different than a little ponytail, but they're both very, very easy to do. And if I do have a little more time and I want it to look a little different, I'm just spraying my heat protector spray on it right now. And then I just take my straightener and I straighten the bottom half of my hair. And this will just give it a little different look because it'll be straight on the bottom instead of having those little bumps in it. Now I am just straightening the sides. And as you guys can tell already, it already looks a little different. It looks kind of like a cleaner look than it does with the little um, like rubber band marks in it. So there's that one. Now for the next hairstyle, I'm just going to take my hair. I'm going to part it in the middle. Take the top sections of my hair. And I'm just taking one of those little rubber bands and I'm just going to be putting two little buns on top of my head. And guys, remember when you're doing these, these little buns do not have to be perfect. Um, the look is kind of to be a little messier. So, And the buns don't have to be the same either. They can be different, but if you are OCD, then yeah, you probably have to make yours the same. I try to make mine the like the same the closest I can but you know that never works out so I just do it like this and there we go that looks so much 
better than just one bun to me, I think. But I think this look looks so cute. It looks so, like, girly. But now I was just trying to pull out some side bangs. But those little elastic bands did not let me do that. So we are just going to take them out and move on to the next hairstyle. For the next one, I'm just going to pull out some side bangs. Take the same sections of hair that I had. And put them in little pigtails. This also just gives it a little different look than the buns because it just looks so cute. And also it makes it look like you spent a little bit of time on your hair and not just three seconds. Just do the same on this side as you did on the other side. That looks so cute. Then I just take my comb and I like to tease my ponytails a little bit, or pigtails, just to give them more volume and make them look a little thicker and stand out a little more. And there we have that one. Also, if you want to make this look look a little different, just take your flat iron and throw a little curls in your side bangs. See, that just makes it look a little different and like you spent three more minutes on your hair than you actually did. And that looks so cute. I'm sorry for throwing up all the peace signs. Uh, I don't know what else to do with my hands except for do peace, peace, peace. So here I'm just showing you guys how it would look with a bun and the side bangs. I love side bangs like... They make every look look so much better, but there you go. That's how it would look with the little buns. Some more peace signs. Sorry, guys. Now I am just parting my hair in the middle again. Throwing in some heat protector spray. And now I'm just going to straighten all of my hair. Now that I have strained all of my hair, you can just leave your hair like this if you want. But with my little daughter, I can't never ever do that because she will be pulling on my hair. But for our next look, you just take this little section of hair, you tuck it behind your ears, and then you pull out some hair like underneath that strand. Tuck it behind your ears and then just pull the back of the hair over it and it looks like that. Just do the same on the other side. Just comb your section. Get your hair out. And tuck it behind your ears. I love how this looks. It looks so clean and nice. And it also looks like you put a little effort in. But, you know, it was barely any effort. And there we have that one. Now I don't pull a lot of hair out, I just do a little bit. Here I'm just showing you guys how much hair I pull out. And there's some more peace signs. Why? I don't know. <laughs> now I'm just taking my hair and I am putting it to the side, like doing a side part. And you can just leave it like this. Everybody knows this is the simplest hairstyle in the world. But for me, if my hair is feeling a little greasy and like I didn't wash it, so I would just do this. I would just comb it to the side and then comb it back on an angle. 
Then I would get my side bangs out. Comb this to the side. Then I just take my scrunchie and I put the bottom like a little ponytail or a bun. Um, depends on how I'm feeling. I put it in a little bun or I will put it in a ponytail. And then it just looks like that. And then your hair doesn't look as greasy. If you do this with greasy hair, it doesn't look as greasy. And for the next one, I just take the same section of hair and I do like a twist. Then I just take any clip that I have. I like this clip because it looks nice. And I just put the hair in there. And I'm going to show you guys how this one looks from the back. There you go. I love how this looks. It looks so cute, I think. That's how it looks in the front. And then I'm just spraying some more heat protectant spray in there. Because, guys, now I am going to be curling my hair. And I am curling it with a flat iron because I love flat iron curls. I think the other curls make my face look a little bit fatter. So I just take my flat iron and I put a little bit of waves in it. I just like how this looks for myself better than the other ones. And now I'm done. And see how the waves look. They look messy and cute. I love how the flat iron um, curls look. So that's why I usually use my flat iron. And then you can just put it on the side like that. Or if you want a little different look, you just take your sides up. I'm just combing them up here. And I'm combing all of it up, like not just the top part. And then I pull the sides down how I want it. And then I would put that up in a scrunchie on the top of my head to make it look like another high pony. And this one just looks a little different with the curls in the front. I think it looks way better. Oh, I am using a little elastic to show you guys how it would look with a smaller elastic rather than a big scrunchie. There you go, and it just looks so cute with the little thing. And now I'm just teasing my hair to make it look like I have more hair back there. I love how that looks with the little elastic band. It just looks so different than a scrunchie. And then the sides, you know, if you didn't get them curled right, I just go in with my flat iron and throw some more curls in there. This just gives it a little more effort. And there you have it, a nice cute look. And then if you want to do a little bit different, you just take the top of your hair and you just put that into a little bun. This just looks different than the ponytail. It just looks like, I don't know, that's so cute I think. Now I am just taking my brush and combing my hair up. Instead of parting it by my eyebrow like I did before, I am combing all of the sides up. I'm not going to leave any of the sides down, just comb them up. Except for the little section in the back I am leaving down. Now I'm just going to take a scrunchie this time and I am going to put it in a high ponytail and I'm just leaving the bottom ends of my hair stick out of the bottom and that just looks a little different than having all of the sides down. Then I just pull hair out of my ponytail like that I want out and then it just makes it look fluffier and then if you want a little different you just take your side bangs and you straighten them with your straightener and that just gives it a different look like it looks so um, different than the curls 
And there you have it, that easy Okay way. guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please let me know and hit that thumbs up button for me. And also guys, comment down below which hairstyle was your favorite. Just say one, two, three, or four, or five, whatever. And then I'm like interested to see which one was your favorite. Also guys, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do that for me. I would appreciate it so, so much. So that is it for today. And I have my special guest here with me to help me say bye to you guys. So she is, she just woke up. So she's a little sleepy. Are you sleepy? I always try to film my videos when she's sleeping, but yeah, she'll, she's probably not gonna say goodbye because she's actually kind of tired. But anyways, guys, I just wanna say, Bye. Thank you guys so, so much for watching my video and I will see you guys in my next video. Say, I will see you too. Bye. I will see you too, guys. <laughs> okay. Bye guys.